Hello Cancer, how are my Cancerians doing? Welcome back. Please understand this is a general reading, not a personal one, so only take what you feel applies to you. Uh, so this is a prediction for what will happen in November this month, okay? Please keep an open mind. This does resonate for Cancer Sun, Moon Rising, and Venus. Okay, so let's get into it. My Cancer Amor. My Cancer Amor. The Cancer that I adore. <laughs> All right, what do we have for Cancer? Am I pulling the wrong cards? I am. I am pulling the wrong cards. All right, so let's get some uh, spirit messages first. Cancer, just to see, you know, what kind of messages that you have, uh, you know, for this month. Guidance from your ancestors, your higher self, spirit guides. I feel like I'm missing some cards though. Am I? Let me check. It could be. Nope. I guess I'm not missing any cards. Oh, all right. Angels, messages for cancer. What do you have? Messages for cancer. Messages for cancer. Messages for cancer. What do we have for cancer? Cancer, you have take a moment. Stop. Now is not the time to rush into the decision you're about to make. Before this important decision is made, take a moment to pause and quiet your mind so that you can ask your soul for guidance before you act or move forward. Synchronicity. Are you noticing the signs of synchronicity that the spirit world has been sending to you at this time? People and situations in your life are not just appearing by coincidence. In reality, they're being guided to you from the spirit world to help you for a specific reason. You are not alone. We are here for you. We never left through all the sadness and loneliness. However, you cannot sense us near you or feel how much love we are sending you. Okay? We are your family, friends, and guides. You never walk alone. We walk right beside you. Beautiful. We have self-sabotage at the bottom of the deck, Cancer. When you learn to get out of your own way, there will be no stopping you. Most of the time, it's not others who prevent you from achieving your true goals. It's that inner voice that derails those carefully woven plans. All right, right Spirit, what do we have for uh, the Cancer Collective in November? What can Cancer expect in the month of November? What can Cancer expect this month? What can Cancer expect this month? Okay, we have the Eight of Coins. What can Cancer expect this month? Cancer. Wow. Seven of Coins. Cancer. So I'm getting Cancer that uh, some of you are uh, going back to work after a period of maybe, you know, maybe you were laid off or maybe you were looking for work or something like that. But I do see if, you know, work has been an issue for you. Um, I do see you getting back to work. Some of you are um, reinvesting in your business or, you know, if this is a, just uh, your business, then I do see you, um, you know, being very focused on your business. But either way, it, it does look to be something that... Um, has to do with work for you this month okay um now i feel like you you are a little frustrated sometimes cancer i think that um um you know you're working very hard you're working very hard you're trying to be as consistent as you can you're trying your best and that's what really matters cancer okay um and patience is a thing for you okay be patient not only with what's going on but with yourself okay um what can cancer expect this month what can cancer expect this month Okay. I see you really having a lot of goals. You have a lot of things that you want to achieve. Uh, cancer. Okay. Um, you have a vision. Okay. And, and, and that's where it all starts. Having a vision, having goals that you want to meet. And at times you may think about the, the road ahead. Um, but spirit is asking that you stay in the moment cancer and you take it one day at a time. Okay. I feel like, like I said, you can get frustrated, aggravated, um, at times, uh, because you have a lot of things that you want to do, a lot of things that you want to accomplish, but I feel like you need to be patient with yourself, cancer. Um, at times you will feel like you want to give up, but I don't see you giving up and that's really good. You know, you're a wounded warrior, but you're still doing all that you can uh, to change your situation, to improve yourself, better yourself. So what can cancer expect this month, angels? What else can cancer expect this month? Okay. We have the fool. What can cancer expect this month, cancer? Some of you I'm hearing, maybe you could be struggling with um, homelessness. It's possible. 
okay and if that's the case you could be getting good news uh, I, I am seeing something about travel uh, you may find that you have a major decision to make okay major life decision you may feel very conflicted um, I'm seeing here cancer that uh, yeah some of you for a lot of you will be starting some kind of new project some type of new job or even with your current existing work um, you are definitely going to be looked at your supervisor will be paying more attention to you this month uh, so make sure obviously you know you give it all that you got you're consistent um, and I feel like you will see the rewards um, you will definitely get to see the rewards cancer okay this is beautiful I like this energy a lot um, so with the fool, I feel like, like I said, you could be starting a new job, a new business, and you're worried, you know, is it going to work out for me? Is this worth the investment? You know, um, how is this going to turn out? Things like that. Um, I, I feel like Spirit is telling you to have faith, um, to believe in yourself. Don't be afraid to take risks this month because I feel like they will pay off in the end. Just be um, patient with yourself, Cancer. So tell me about this fool for Cancer this month. Uh, you taking this leap. You doing whatever you need to do. Some of you, you had a lot of options. You'll have a lot of job offers, a lot of opportunities coming towards you this month. Um, I feel like a lot of them have to do with you traveling, okay? Some of you could be uh, being sent on some type of, uh, what is it? Assignment or project that uh, requires travel, um, cancer, okay? So you could be relocating uh, for your job, moving to relocate, finding a better job elsewhere. And I feel like you will be successful at whatever move you're going to make. Um, tell me about this eight of wands for cancer. But the important thing is that you're determined, you're passionate. Okay, you're determined, you're passionate, um, you have a vision, um, and you're in that fire energy. So when you're in that fire energy, all you can do is bust moves, okay? Um, there is something strongly about traveling cancer, so be prepared for that, okay? Um, be prepared for that cancer. You may have a choice between two jobs, two, two job offers, two career paths, or whatever the case may be, cancer, but um, I feel like um, for the most part, this month is all about persevering. This month is all about patience. This month is all about basically... Um, you know, putting in that effort, being consistent, um, showing that dedication, um, putting in that that effort, uh, cancer, okay? And I feel like you will definitely reap the benefits of that, my love, for sure. All right, so what else do we have for cancer this month, please, cancer? Cancer, you have Azor. Your desired outcome will occur in the very near future. Have patience and faith and don't try to force it. You see what I said? You need to have patience and faith, okay? Easier said than done, but I feel like your outcome is going to, um, you're going to get the desired outcome that you want this month, um, Cancer. If that's to get a promotion, get a raise, you know, um, uh, get more clientele you know some of you i'm hearing you're working in sales or your work is very physical or uh you know things like that i feel like you'll definitely hit your milestones reach your goals so cancer you have you have a special bond with animals your pets on earth and in heaven are watched over by angels some of you i'm hearing your pet may have passed away okay or you're worried about your pet Okay, you have spend time alone in nature, meditating about your desires and intentions. Ask the angels to help you gain a positive perspective. Cancer. So this was a beautiful reading. Know that you're not alone, okay? Um, pay attention to the signs that Spirit is sending you, okay? Uh, take a moment. Take a moment. Reassess what's going on. And then, you know. Go get it, baby. Go get them, tiger. Okay? So that's what I have for you, Cancer. Thank you so much for tuning in. Love you all. Talk to you guys soon.